quite uh, quite an exciting read. It was definitely quite an exciting experience writing it, um, and it is a big journey, my kind of journey through my life until this point, which has been quite eventful for sure. So. I think, I hope that people will, I hope that it will make people cry, That's and I hope that it will make people laugh at the same time. That seems to have been some of the reactions that I've had from people so far. What I really hope is that it's like a very, very human read, and it's very true, um, and it was inspired by a very, very painful experience, um, and I have put the absolute truth of my emotions into it, um, because I think that if somebody's taking the time to read your book, then you you kind of owe them your complete honesty. So I had a really, really happy childhood, a kind of picture-perfect childhood, really. I was very, very lucky, and I'm the youngest of five children, and my mother was very loving and really, really wonderful. But then, when I was 16, my mum had a riding accident. She was in a coma for three months, or well, three, four months. She didn't, her waking up process was quite slow. Um, and she sustained really chronic, horrific brain damage. And she couldn't. After that, she couldn't. Um, she couldn't really look after herself in any way at all. But, but what was most um, difficult was she couldn't communicate at all. She did sort of vaguely have a sense of when you went into the room. She sometimes would kind of make a strange noise or wave her arms around. But basically, she was just sitting in a chair in a nursing home for the next 22 years, um, and that propelled me out in life and onto a series of adventures, I suppose, um, or catastrophes, however you like to look at it, in a way, sort of looking for her and trying to come to terms with what had happened. You know, I would do anything to see my mum, and I really, really miss my mum, but I'm also aware that the accident inspired me in a way that I might not have been inspired had it hadn't happened. I mean, it's an impossible question to answer, that hypothetical question of what would have happened without it.